اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم I'm going to give mic to A1130 السلام علیکم وعلیکم السلام How are you? I'm fine Alhamdulillah How are you? Alhamdulillah I'm fine Jazakallah for asking So do you see the screen properly? Yes Okay So we are going to start our class with this prayer. Now, will it be okay to read it by yourself or shall I read and you will follow? Can you read and follow? Oh, okay, that's fine. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Rabbish rahli saduri. Rabbish rahli saduri. Wa yassir li amri. Wa yassir li amri. Can you please read the translation underneath for me, please? Lord, expand me, expand my mind, and make my task easy for me. In bracket, uh, this these verses are taken from. Taha twenty six dash twenty seven. Yeah, so th- these verses are taken from the Holy Quran, Surah Taha, <laughs> and the verses are twenty six and twenty seven. So Jazakallah A1130. Jazakallah. Now, quick reminder about class etiquette. Hope all of you have uh, done wazu and wearing clean clothes. In case of Atwal members, you must cover your head with cap or topi. And in case of Nasrat members, you must cover your head with scarf or dupatta. And now for, uh, there are a lot of... Now, if we pass from our course, so you must enter with your proper ID. Otherwise, we can't uh, press your attendance and we can't give you mic and can't listen and can't note your progress. So there is one person who is not with proper ID. I'm going to uh, remove you from the class. Please uh, re-enter in the class with your proper ID. So it's Ab- Abkina or if I'm not pronouncing it wrong. So... I'm going to remove you from the class. Please come with your proper ID. Jazakallah. And now, hope uh, you are all Atfal and Nasrat will be accompanied by the, their parents or mother or father. And um, all of you know, and we'll make announcements there till the external exam. Uh, our external exam will be on 6th of November on Monday. So keep revising what you learn. And uh, on weekend, you will have more time to listen to classes again and again and revise. And you have to be very focused when you do rev- a revision on your timing. So most of you know how to pronounce the stroke, what sound they will make, what sound of the letters they will make. But we really struggle some time on timing. So the best way is to when you recite something or when you are revising, record your voice and then listen it again and see whether your timing is right or not. On simple strokes, whether you are giving one second time on uh, madda and um, on vertical vertical strokes, you must give two second time and then nasal sound and the stuff. So uh, it's better to record yourself and then listen again whether you are where you need help so to perfect your timing it's a good way so keep on revising inshallah next week uh, we will revise uh, the lessons as well but on weekend you will have more time to revise your lessons so practice and be focused on your uh, timing it must be accurate so now we are going to start our lesson hopefully other members will join us Okay. Yesterday, you have uh, learned about soft elongation, madlin, and in it, we basically, the lean means to ease or to soften. In elongation, you taste that haruful mad, da, alif, wow, ya, when uh, alif, wow, uh, by a preceded letter has fatha and uh, in case of ya uh, when preceding letter has kasra and in case of wow when preceding letter has dhamma then we along that sound but in this lesson we are going to learn how we pronounce letters having lean 
So lean means basically to ease or to soften. And in the rules of recitation, if wow and ya, so if this is a typo mistake, it's not ha, it's ya. So it's wow and ya are strokeless and preceded by a consonant bearing the stroke of fatha. So here only if wow and ya are strokeless and preceded by a mean that they are silent and <coughs> excuse me by a consonant bearing the stroke of fatha they are called al haruf al lean so letters of ease so in this case uh, the first one is if i highlight this one so alif having fatha and then vow so it will be ao high this one so only the, the letters before wow and ya they carry the stroke of fatha so the, if we read this one you you have learned about it yesterday so au hai na so i'm going to give mic to one of the students so let's see how far they catch it and then we will practice the stuff so i think in charge discipline is not here okay i'm going to give mic to n1207 assalamu alaikum wa alaikum salam how are you i'm fine alhamdulillah alhamdulillah so have you attended yesterday's class yes okay do you know how to pronounce well Haruf al lean or letters, lean letters. Yes. Okay. Can you help me? Can you read this one for me, please? Bainakum. Once more, please. Bainakum. Okay. That's fine. Just, just you uh, had need bit practice on your timing. So how we read this one? How next one, please? Lie and how we read this one? The whole that word, how lie me so over here? The this which stroke this noon carrying? Kasra, kasra. So it's a simple kasra, only one second. So, how we read it? How lie me. How laini? How laini? How so, laini? So we don't uh, pronounce it like ni, okay? okay? So now we start practicing six uh, exercise sixteen point three. Mm -hmm. So we, we are going to start from here. Can you start reading from here, please? Hi, so just just bit can you tell me which letter this one is no no see don't have dot and it, so this one is tha. so bit bit soft letter so uh, you you will pronounce this letter while the tip of your tongue touch the the knee of your upper teeth so it's tha. so it's hai suk Hi, Next one, please. Laila tu. Once more, please. Laila tu. Next one, please. Pakaifa. Next one. Shahraini. Once more, please. Shahraini. So this one here, just bit. A sound. This is a. Thin ha, soft ha, so it's shahraini. Shahraini. Next one, please. Ra, ra aita. One small, please. Ra aita. Yeah, when uh, when ra uh, carrying fatha, it's a bit rounded. Not you make your whole face round, just bit rounded. Ra, ra aita. Okay. Jazakallah N1207. 
Keep on practicing and be mindful about your timing. Jazakallah. Now I'm going to give mic to Mm, yeah, it's A triple one two and N one two one seven together. Waalaikum asalaam. Waalaikum asalaam. How are you? Fine. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. So it's uh, your ID is A triple one two or N. A triple one two. Okay. So have you attended yesterday's class? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Can you please help me and start reading from here? Ataina. Once more, please. Ataina. Yeah. You're reading quite well. Just be mindful. It sounds that you are joining Alif and Ta together. So you are reading it. Yeah. It's, if you read it once more, please. Because it sounds that you are joining. Yeah. Ah, Taina. Once more, please. Hello. Can you read it once more, please? Ah, Taina. Yeah. Just be mindful that it sounds that you are joining Alif and Ta together. So it's not a taina, it's a taina. So, a triple one two, can you hear me? Hello? Can you hear me properly, A triple one two? Hello? Hello? A triple one two. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Just I'm saying that um, when you are reading, it sounds that you are joining Alif and Ta together. So can you read it once more and be mindful that Alif is separate. Ah, and then Taina. Ah, Taina. Okay. Next one, please. Bye. Kia. Once more, and don't along it too much. Bye, Tia. Bye, Tia. Bye, Tia. Next one, please. Naina. Which letter is this one? The red one. Pa. Yeah. Read it once again, please. Baina. Baina. Next one, please. Baina. Next one, please. Kalaina. No, which letter is this one? The first one? Pa. This one. Kalaina. No, uh, this is fa. This letter is fa. So how you read it? Fa aina. Next one, please. Kaira. So just uh, need pronounce the rain ra from your throat. Read it once more, please. Gaira. So it's Gaira. Gaira. And then, can you give mic now to N1217, please? Yes, I go. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? Good. How are you? Alhamdulillah. I'm fine. Zakhila for asking. Can you uh, start reading from the next line, please? Mu'menini. 
once more please bye mo me nahi ni so it's mo me nahi ni mo me nahi ni next one please kai da so this this scarf is thin one you read it like uh, while uh, like smiley face kai da kai da next one please oration once more please oration yeah bit bit o oration oration so it's tanween on a uh, sheen so it will be oration oration it's not qur'aishin there is no alif so it's qu ray shin qu ray shin so try to read it in one go please qu ray shin qu ray shin qu ray shin yeah bit we, we pronounce the the mean sound bit longer qu ray shin Oration. Next one, please. Bidainen. Next one, please. Ainun. Once more, please. Ainun. Hmm. Because here we have tanween on in last three letters, so the first one will be oration. Bidainen. Ainun. So Jazakallah N one two one seven. Mashallah, both of you read really well. So keep on practicing. So you will Inshallah rectify your tiny mistakes. So Jazakallah A triple one two and N one two one seven. Jazakallah. So now I'm going to give mic to. Let me see. Just bear with me. Uh, so today, don't have support teacher. Otherwise, the giving mic system will be a bit. So now I'm going to unmute A triple one nine and N one triple two. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum salam. How are you? Uh, good. Alhamdulillah. Oh, I... Alhamdulillah, I'm fine. Jazakumullah for asking. So, have you attended yesterday's class? No. No. So, have you attended uh, the today's class from the beginning? No. Okay. So now we are learning about huruf lean. So, yes, I quickly go through what it means. lean means to ease or to soften in the rules of recitation if wow and ya so this is a typo mistake it's not ha it's ya are strokeless and preceded by a consonant bearing the stroke of fatha they are called al huruf al lean or letters of ease so these are the examples for example here it's alif carrying fatha and then wow with sukoon so it will be au then ha fatha ya with sukoon hai au hai na same here it will be how lai ni how lai ni then the next one is yau mai ni yau mai ni can you uh, can you read this one for, first for me the highlighted one the whole word Okay. And here the noon have fatha, and it's followed by alif madda, so it's na. So how you read it? Read it once more, please. Oh hey na. Oh hey na. Oh hey na. So this this ha is thick ha. So it will its sound will be like ha ha. So it's oh hey na. Oh hey na. Next one, please. 
Hey, hey, Lonnie. So it's ha going further, and then wow second is wow lean. So it will be how. 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 How lady. So this noon uh, carrying on uh, having only simple kasra. So just one second. So it will be how lady. How lady. Next one, please. Shabash, yeah. you are doing really well. Yo, yo, money. So it's meme with fatha and it's followed by ya. So it will be, if they are preceded by a consonant bearing the stroke of fatha, they are called haruful lean or letters of ease. So it, it sound will be eased, my. Okay. So now read it, the whole word, please. How, how. No, this last one, please, this one. Um. Ma, ni. If if you just start from this this part. Yo mai ni. Yo mai ni. Yep. Mashallah, good try. Can you tell me your ID, please? A triple one nine. Okay. Will it be okay? Can you read a couple of more words? Will it be okay? Yes. Okay, well done. Just a quick announcement. If uh, A triple one eight, if you close your video, please. This Can you start from this one, the first? Hi, so. So just just be mindful. You read it right. That this is so sound, but it's just. Simple stroke, just one second. Read it once more, please. Hey, so. Yeah, and this high is thick, thick, have uh, ha, so it will be high. Hi, so. Hi, so. So, and uh, this is the sound, like th sound in English, like thank you thing. So, tip of your tongue touches the underneath of your upper teeth. So, read it once more, please. Hi, so. So hope all the class is listening uh, carefully because if uh, we are telling one thing to the student who is unmuted, it's not specifically for only for that student, it's for whole class. If you make a note and then when you are practicing, keep in mind that point, so it will help you a lot. Can you read the next letter? Next word, please. Leila to. Once more, please. Leila to. Yeah, next one. Fa, 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 ki fa. So you read it fa well. So it's ka having hefa ta and then ya. So it's ya lean. So it will be kai. Read it again, please. Fa kai fa. So, Fakaifa. Fakaifa. Next one, please. Shahra, shahrani. So, it will be, it's thin. Sha. Shahraini. Shahraini. Read it once more, please. Shahraini. Next one, please. Ra, 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 aita. Once more, please. Ra, aita. And the ra sound when a ra is scanning for tha, it will be raw. Ra, aita. Ra, aita. Well done. So keep on practicing. It will really help you and uh, be mindful about the timing and the sound of the letters where you produce thick sound, where thin sound. Mashallah, you are.
practice it sees uh, you are practicing but uh, try to attend your classes regularly and keep on practicing so can you give mic to your sister please Waalaikum. Waalaikum salam. But can you? Uh, so your ID is N one triple two, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Just one minute. Do you understand about which thing we are learning? We are doing practice. Yeah. Do you? Okay. So can you start reading from the second line, please? N one triple two. Ah. Ah, they not. Just read it once more and be mindful. There is no jerking sound when you are pronouncing ah. It's a uh, simple a uh, taina. Read it once more, please. A uh, taina. Yeah? So uh, I'll read it and read after me. It's a uh, a uh, taina taina. So no jerking sound. When you say a, uh, it means that you're adding hamza or jerk sound in it. So it's a uh, taina. Next one, please. So it's Baitia. Baitia. Read it once more, please. So it's ba carrying fatha and then ya sak followed by ya sakin. So it's ya lean. So it's bai. Bai tia. Bai tia. Next one is bai na. Bai na. So which, which letter is the first one? So this is ba. So where it cover ya lean, then it will be baina. Baina. Next one. So read it. It's fa. So it, it is Faaina. Faaina. Well done. And the last one is Goiro. 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 Yes, Goinsan or Ro. Goiro. So on weekend and so you will have time and then listen to the recordings of uh, yesterday and today's class and keep on practicing okay you are trying well but keep on practicing and inshallah with the passage of time you will improve a lot so jazakumullah a triple one nine and n one triple two So now I'm going to unmute A double one double one. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? I am fine. Alhamdulillah. How are you? Alhamdulillah. I'm fine. So do you understand how to read? Uh, if you make your volume a bit slow because I'm hearing my sound again. 
Can you start reading uh, from the last line, please? Can you start reading uh, from the last line, please? Mo, mo, minein, mo, minaini. Once more, please. Once more, please. Mo, minaini. So it's minaini. Mo, minaini. Next one, please. Next one, please. Okay, I'm going to, uh, okay, I'm going to give uh, my cue uh, again. I think due to some technical problem, I'm listening my voice. Okay. So we'll come back to you by now. So if I ask my charge discipline, if you give mic to one of the students, please. I'm going to give mic to N1218. Assalamu alaikum, N1218. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? Good. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the last line, please? Okay. Mu me mu me. Mu'minaini. Once more, please. Mu'minaini. Next one, please. Kaida. Urayshin. And here is the Nveen, so we'll say Shin. Once more, please. Urayshin. Urayshin. Oration. Next one, please. Be dining. Be dining. Be dining. Next one, please. Wailun. Once more, please. Wailun. Okay. So it's Wailun. Wailun. Okay, Jazakumullah N1218. Keep on practicing and be mindful about your timing. How much time you are going to give simple strokes and how much to Madda and Tanveen one. So Jazakumullah. Can we have next student, please? A1120. So it's A1120. Yeah. Aslam Alaikum, A1120. Assalamu alaikum, A1120. Oh, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the first line, please? Okay. Hi, so. so this letter is, which, uh, what this letter called? What's its alphabetical name? Mm. So. It's Sa. Uh, it's like th sound in English, so you produce the sound by the tip of your tongue. That's the end of your upper teeth. So it's su su, like th sound. Hi su. Hi fu. Next one, please. Lai la tu. Once more, please. Lai la tu. Try to read it in a one go. Please. Laila tu. So just one second to two sound. Laila tu. Laila tu. Next one, please. Fakaifa. 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 So be mindful when there is simple stroke, simple fatha, kasra, and dhamma, we only give one second time. Can you read it once more, please? Fakaifa. Next one, please. Dahraini. Once more and try to, the, this ha sound is thin, thin sound. So no uh, thick sound or no sound coming from your throat. Read it once more, please. Dahraini. Next one, please. Raaina.
treat it see what which letters are these and which strokes and then read it again please uh, raita so it's ra aita ra aita raita not raita ra aita ra aita so okay say it say it, uh, after me it's ra ra ai ai ta ta ra aita ra aita now read it once more take your time and then read it ra aita well done can you read the first letter once more please first word sorry hi su once more please hi su so th this this ha is big thick and it's a sound coming from your throat like ha ha sound so it's hi su hi su yeah and the su sound is no hissing sound like seen and no saw a rounded sound like saw it's su sound like flow of air come uh, for before and then the sound of the letter so th sounds like thank you or saying so it's hi su hi su so it's not so just uh, it's your additional homework on weekend so to keep on practicing this sound the tip of your tongue that touches the beneath your upper teeth so it's su su sound flow of air come forward and then the sound of the letter su su can you read it once more please hi su hi su hi tu So, Jazakumullah. A double one two zero. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank
अलहमदुल्ला आंटी हाँ जी My sister, my sister is with me as well. You already had a boy. Uh, what's her ID? Eight one two one seven. So, your ID is A triple one two, and your sister ID is. Oh, we have. Yeah. I have listened from you, isn't uh, it? Yeah. 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 Okay. Now, uh, oh, yeah. Inshallah, next time, um, I yeah. we will give you mic in next class. So okay. Can we have other student, please? थिंग So, can you read it once more, please? Be mindful which letters and which strokes they are. Mu aminaini. So there is no a sound after mu. It uh, is. Uh, she's looking at the hamza on the uh, vowel. Okay, okay. So it is a uh, when hamza is uh, on a uh, any letter, whether it's ya or vowel or any other letter is. just this letter serve as a chair so it's a hamza is a person on a chair and when while we are sitting on a chair person speak chair doesn't speak so you are making right sound of this mu mu and then mi nai ni so just ignore the vowel and then mu mi nai ni mi nai ni once more please mu mi nai ni So when uh, you are uh, joining uh, Hamza, then it will be a bit light jerk. Mu mi nai ni. Mu mi nai ni. Once more, please. Mu mi nai ni. Mu mi nai ni. Well done. Next one, please. Kai da. Well done. Next one, please. Kuraishin. And then the, this the mean sound, we, we will uh, say it like shin. To read it once more, please. Shin. Shabash. Next one, please. Kitaikin. Once more, please. Kitaikin. Last one, please. Ainun. Once more, please, and try to make proper ain sound coming from your throat. A ainun, ainun. Well done. So keep on practicing, and inshallah, on sixth of November there will be external exam. So inshallah, we will see how far you are progressing. And next week, inshallah, we will do a lot of revision as well. It is Abmala A double one two five. Can we have next student, please? Lakla. N one two two five. Sorry, I can't hear the ID. N one two two five. Assalamualaikum. N one two two five. Assalamualaikum. I think no one there. Can we have another student, please? N one two one two. Assalamualaikum. N one two. Hello. Waalaikum salam. How are you? I'm fine. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the first line, please? Amma. Um, mm, this one, the highlighted one. Yama. So it's yauma. So this is the we are learning about soft elongation. So, ya carrying fatha and then wow sukun or akin it will be yau yau ma. Yau ma. Next one please. Yau. Next please. 
How long? And with with the last one. How we pronounce the last letter? It's who. So it will be how la who. How la who. So this ha is thick ha thick sounds are coming from your throat ha how la who. How la who. Next one, please. La sofa. Once more, please. La sofa. Yeah, it's la sofa. La la sofa. La sofa. La sofa. La sofa. Next one, please. Yeah, Al is right. Tu is right. That's middle one, the red and uh, blue one. How we read it? Al mautu. Yeah, Al mautu. Al mautu. Well then, Jazakumullah. And one, two, one, two. Keep on practicing. Can we have next student, please? A one one zero seven. Assalamualaikum. A one one zero seven. Assalamu alaikum, A1107. Anyone there? No. Can we have next student, please? Can we have another student? Assalamu alaikum. Um, no one there, I think. Papa, do you want to do one? Assalamu alaikum. So your ID is A1121, yeah? Yeah. Okay, how are you? Fine, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the second line, please? Okay. Wado. Well then, next one, please. Tawallo. So it would be, yeah, it can shed the bit hardened sound. Tawallo. Tawallo. Then next one, please. Taro. So it's thin letter. Now you pronounce it like with smiling face. Taro. 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 Next one, please. Taro. It's, it will be like we are learning about Taro. clean sound. Yeah? Yeah. Read it once more, please. Taro. Yeah, it's to and ro. It. Yeah, it's uh, no jerking sound, just simple to and go. To go. To go. Next one, please. Ola. Okay. Can you read the last letter once, last word once more, please? Ola. Well done, Shabash. A1121. Can we have next student, please? Zakmullah A1121. And 1216. Oh. Assalamu alaikum, N1216. Salam. Okay, I think I have heard from you, you yeah? Yeah. Okay. Uh, can we have another student, please? N1226. N1226, yeah. as-salamu alaykum. 
Assalamualaikum. Salam. How are you? I'm fine. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the last line, please? Tansona. Once more, please. Tansona. It's a bit, bit nasal sound involved. Inshallah, in coming lessons we will read it. So it will be Tansona. Tansona. Next one, please. Ba o a. Well done. You are, you try to produce proper ayin sound. Can you read it once more, please? Fa o a. So it will be fa o a. Fa o a. Next one, please. Yo man. So it will be yao man. Yao man. Next one, please. Yus kauna. Next, please. Pau kahum. Once more, please. Pau kahum. Yes. Yeah, this is uh, rounded face. This scarf is. So it will be Pau kahum. Pau kahum. Well done, Shambash. Keep on practicing. Can we have next student? Zakla N1226. Zakla A1 and T1. Zero. Alaikum. Aslam Alaikum. So it's A1130, yeah? A1121. Okay. A1121. Aslam Alaikum. I had it by go. Okay, no problem. Jazakallah for telling us. The Can we have another? Pale. Okay. Pale, pale mera go up. Ko, koi baat nahi. Ham kisi ho ko mic yeah. de dete. Jazakallah for telling us. Can we have another student, please? A1130. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum salam. How are you? I'm fine, Alhamdulillah. How are you? Alhamdulillah. I think you have uh, read the prayer only, haven't participated in the exercise. Yeah. Okay. Can you start reading from the first line, please? Hi, Su. Once more, please. Hi, Su. Next one, please. Layla, Su. Next. Once more, please. So just it's uh, all letters are a bit thin and lean, so it will be fa kaifa. Next one, please. So th this hard, there's no no a jerk and no thick sound in it. So it's shahraini. Shahraini. Next one, please. Yeah. And when Ra has a fatha, it will be a bit rounded. Ra. Ra Aita. Ra Aita. Jazakmullah A1130. Can we have next student, please? Sorry, it's N1. Uh, one, two, one, five. Aslam N1215. Assalamu alaikum. Are you there? N1215? No one there. Can you give mic to someone else, please? N1226. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? I'm fine. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Can you start reading from the second line, please? Athena. Next, please. Baitia. So it bit bit uh, lean on down one. Baitia. Baitia. Next one, please. Baina. Next. Baina. Once more, please. Baina. Yes, good. It's fine. Next one, please. 
once more, please. Oiro. Yeah, it's a oiro. Oiro. Is Akila in one, two, two, six? Can we have next student, please? Two, one, one, three, four. Asalaamu Alaikum, A, one, one, three, four. Assalamualaikum A one one three four. Can you hear us A one one three four? I already had my go. Oh, you have. Okay, so if wait, uh, can we have another student, please? Bye. Assalamualaikum. Walikum Salam. Can you tell me your ID, please? I one one three zero. No, I one one three four. Um. Okay. Uh, oof. I think there's uh, two students are unmuted. So your ID is A one one three four. Have you read to in today's class? No. Okay. Can you start reading from the last line, please? So it is Mu'minaini. Mu'minaini. Next one, please. Kaida. Yeah, it's Kaida. Kaida. Next one, please. Kurei. Shin. Yes. It is Kureishin. Kureishin. Next one, please. Bidaiinin. Try to read it once more, please. Bidaiinin. Yeah. Bidaiinin. Bidaiinin. Last one, please. I nun. Yeah, it's I in sound, so it's I nun. I nun. Jazakallah, A11, A34. So now, a quick reminder about uh, her homework. So it's weekend. Keep on practicing uh, exercise 16.2, C and 16.3, uh, which uh, about which we practice in today's class, and also practice exercise 15.3, which you see on your screen. So I request A1130 if you uh, put your video off. Jazakumullah. Uh, so if uh, your homework is uh, keep practicing on your weekend, listen to the lessons and uh, recording again and again and practice exercise 15.3 and exercise 16.2 and 16.3 until you are fluent. And again, quick announcement that your external exam will be on 6th of November on Monday. So keep on revising all the lessons so far you have learned. And inshallah, in coming weekend, we'll do more and more practice. So can we have a student uh, to re help us reading and prayer? N1208. Aslam Likum N1208. Aslam Likum. Walikum Slam. How are you? Good. Alhamdulillah. So, will it be okay for you to read this prayer by yourself or shall I read and you will follow? I'll read by myself. Okay. Start reading, please. And everybody join us. Allahumma alhamni. Can you read the translation underneath, please? Oh Allah, have mercy on me through the great Quran. Jazakum Allah. So the, every, and, uh, every time we do recitation, we do this prayer. And it is, Allahumma rahamni bil Quran al -Azim. So Jazakum Allah for helping us and keep on revising. So your homework is six, uh, revised exercise 15.3 and 16.2 and 16.3 until you are fluent. Uh, so Jazakum Allah to all. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.